Hey guys, it's Sam. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. For today's video, I have a first impression on the It Cosmetics Foundation Brush. I really, really like the end result. At first, I was a little bit, um, like hesitant because I have used other foundation brushes and I really really didn't like the result they li they will leave like streaks on my face and I really really didn't like it um, but I was actually really impressed with this foundation brush before we get started please don't forget to subscribe in the little button down there and let's get started with this first impression okay so for today's first impression I have the it cosmetics foundation brush and Kathleen lights has raved about this brush so many times in so many videos and um, I've been wanting to try it. I am not a foundation brush girl. Like I've tried the M439 by um, by Morphe, and Jaclyn Hill has raved about that brush so many times. And I gave it a go, and I just didn't like it. It left. I don't know if I was doing it wrong, maybe. Um, but yeah, it was. I just didn't like how my foundation looked. So I'm gonna go ahead and give this a try. It's so pretty. It has a bunch of like little hearts. Um, it reminds me of like Valentine's Day, but this is the Love Beauty um, foundation and it's like kind of like in the shape of a heart, which is cute. It comes in this like packaging um, and I bought it at Ulta and this is um, a limited edition, um, I guess like the packaging and it's so pretty. It looks, it feels super soft, like so soft. So I wanted to give this a go because Kathleen Lights has raved about this brush so many times and I'm, I want to try with my favorite foundation. I don't know how it's going to look. Um, hopefully good because I need to go to work later today. I'm going to go ahead and apply some moisturizer. This is the Ultra Repair Cream by First Aid Beauty. And I'm going to apply this to my face. It's been so dry. And I don't like it. For my foundation, I'm going to be using my favorite Fenty uh, foundation. Fenty Beauty foundation. This is in the color 210. It's the Pro Filter Soft Matte Longwear Foundation. And I have been loving this foundation. It just, the color is perfect for my skin tone. It's super matte. I tend, well, I mean, I used to have oily skin. Um, obviously, the weather's changing here. It's been like really, really dry. So that's why I've been like moisturizing my face like crazy. Um, but we're gonna go ahead and use this foundation for today's first impression. I'm just gonna dot this on my face. And I'm just gonna work slowly it is so soft okay it blended so quickly but I do see I feel like it gives me less coverage than um, sponge, which I always thought that foundations gave you a more um, like full coverage look. I'm just going to play a little bit more of foundation. And I'm just using circular motions to buff this into my skin. And it says to buff the foundation in circular motions. I like it but I do see I don't know maybe it's because I'm not used to like using a brush and I'm being like super picky but I see like my foundation is like I can see it like my pores I feel like my pores a little bit more visible with um, blending the foundation with my brush And I'm definitely using um, like more foundation than I would regularly use. A little bit of foundation got on my eyebrow. Don't worry, girls, I got you. I like the finish. Like it definitely um, looks a little bit more like natural with the brush. So um, if I look like close up, um, it looks a little bit more like cakier than it would look with my sponge. And I don't know, like it looks, like from afar it looks good. Oh, sorry, my lighting. Um, from afar it looks good, uh, but if I see like close up, it just, I feel like it's, it looks a little bit cakier than with my sponge. 
I'm going to go ahead and put some concealer on and I'm going to use the same brush to um, blend that. I'm going to put a little bit on my nose. Like I feel like it looks cakey. Like everything looks cakey. Which I usually don't have a problem with my foundation or my concealer looking cakey. It blends my foundation really pretty um, and easy. Like it's so easy to like blend my foundation. Um, but from afar it looks fine. Uh, but when I do like, when I look in the mirror close, it looks cakey. But it doesn't leave any like, doesn't look streaky, which I'm liking. Yeah, I think I like how it looks. Um, I'm going to go ahead and set my foundation and my under eye. I can't take out my powder. I'm going to go ahead and set the rest of my face and I'll be right back. So that is it for today's first impression. I really hope you guys enjoyed and if you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the little button down there. As always, all of the products that I use in this video are going to be linked down in the description box as well as all of my social media. And until then, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!